I mean, yeah, also, I have every I have every version of Skyrim that you can buy for PC I have, and then I also have it on Switch. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I feel like I do deserve it for free. <laughs> but, but, uh, Bethesda relaunch a 10-year-old game a thousand times, make you pay for an upgrade? Uh, yeah... I mean, they don't need the money, right? I still want to know whether or not the mod authors who made all this content got any of the money. Because if they did, then I would even more so be like, yeah, it's worth paying for because they, you know, are getting paid for their work. Yeah, I mean, some of these house mods in particular do make the game cheaty, I, I think, purely because of how easy it is to come across, like you said. Ooh! Ooh! I thought it would be a loading screen. I like all the different uh, positions of these mannequins. There's one like, hey, then there's one just very casual. Another one that's like, hey. Interesting that they're all male. However, the game doesn't have any female mannequins, does it? I don't think it does. Do you guys want to know a creepy fact? So these mannequins are actually NPCs that are scripted to not move. They are actually living beings. <laughs> Bit creepy. I don't like the Crusader armor mod either, just full suit, fully enchanted endgame armor, up for the grabs. Right, so we literally, that was the first thing we did this stream, was go and get this armor. But my Crusaders were already dead. Some, some, something killed them. And I was just sort of like, oh okay, like, so I get the armor? So, yeah, no, I, like the quality of the armor, really cool. The manner of acquiring it, yeah, like... You could just make a new character, go straight there, pick it up. Boom. Weeping angels. Yeah. Sometimes they don't move. Yeah. That bug where they would, like, come to life and walk around. <laughs> Be back in a bit. All right, FS. I wait for Todd to release Skyrim on Smart Fridge. Yeah, dude. Okay, so this is an armory then, I'm guessing. Blood scale blade. Ooh, okay. So you got a mini legacy of the Dragon Board. Uh, Dragonborn board over here. Wait, Champion's Blade? Is that what it said? Grand Champion's Blade? Oh no. Okay. Never mind. I thought it was going to like let me put the stuff I already had on there then. Okay. It looks... It, it's cool. It's it's small. That I like that about it. It's the, the Dwemer one is really big. Like, I feel like if you had loads of companions, it would be a cool place to have. This one is a bit more humble. I like it. Um... We just have to kill a Nord to get it, which again, a little bit gamey, but it's a nice place. I think this place is pretty cool. My main criticism though with like these, any of these house mods is, so I've not really played Hearthfire because I've never been compelled to like build my own house. It's not something I've really thought about in the Elder Scrolls when I'm playing it. Um... But now I'm, like, even less inclined to do it anyway. You know what I mean? It would be cool if you had to use the Hearthfire mechanics to furnish these places. But again, like, I'd, I don't know how you would script all that and get it to work, but... That's just one suggestion how you can make it less gamey. It is physically, uh, visually, I should say, nice to look at. Cool. So, uh, that was Hendrenheim. Now, the next place to go and have a look at is... We did these two really quickly. Is, uh... The load. Alright, we need to head to the hot springs. Stay for 
first, my friend. Moist. Yes, the hot springs. <laughs> I think interest in NPCs adds people bathing in the hot springs. Or crash. No, no, I think we'll be okay. We got the crash out of the way. Uh, Alrighty. Hopefully Donglas has learned his lesson about dishonoring me in combat. Why you even gotta say things like that, Liv? Especially when everyone in chat is going to agree with you. Donglas, did you... Todd, give me my frames back. Did you learn your lesson? I see that you ate this woman. Or she came back to life or something. Playing my own hardcore run, times 3 damage for both me and my enemy, time 5, slower level in survival mode. No CC content unless I already own a full suit equivalent base in game. All right, okay, cool. Very nice. Okay, we're heading to the the hot springs. All the way there. So the closest place that we found is going to be good old Stony Creek Cave. Hot springs. Mm. If there's not at least one Argonian at the hot springs, I'll be upset. Talking my mic mute. But I was talking to myself, so it's fine. Okay. We need to head. Boop. That way. Onwards, Donglas. He's on a mission, just- What the fuck?! That's a cool horse! Yo! Wait, Donglas, hold on. I did say I might replace you because of how you disrespected me, so hold on. Donglas is like, I'm gonna kick his ass. He's not taking her away from me. Hold on. Where'd that horse go? Is Donglas fighting the horse? Wait, come back! Come, come, wait! Speckles! I'm gonna call you Speckles! Come back! Speckles, love me! Speckles! Oh, you can't go much further, Speckles! Come! Right. Now listen here, okay? No, behave. Calm down, Speckles. Look, let me sh let me show you Donglas, okay? He used to be a nice boy. He might make you eat Whoa! Calm down. Donglas. Successfully tamed him. Nice. Donglas is just leaving. Oh wait, no, he's not. Right. Donglas, this is Speckles. Well don't be like that. Oh my god, I can't it's actually breaking my heart. Donglas, I didn't mean it, he didn't mean anything. No, shut up. I'm sorry, Donglas. I'll never do that to you again. Why don't we kill a skeever for all time's sake? Wasn't that nice? Oh, that was a wolf. Not like a skeever. Whoa! Bye, buddy. Speckles following me? Yeah, okay, no. I was only joking, Donglas. Do you really think I was going to give you up for speckles? 
just trying to teach you a lesson. Onglus. It looked like a unicorn. Uh, sadly, it was not a unicorn. It was just a speckly horse. Yeah, there's several horses that you can tame. Just putting it out there, though. Yeah, yeah, nice one, uh, Ovo. I appreciate that. Um, I was just going to reiterate. If anyone has played any of the Creation Club content in Anniversary Edition, uh, don't spoil it or anything like that. Um, yeah. Right. We are looking for the Atronauk Stone. Trying to figure out where I'm going. It's this way. No Argonians at the hot springs yet. <laughs> Thanks, Holly. How you doing? Very nice to see you. Hope you're doing well. You're free, as always, to lurk. Oh, bear and a wolf, wolf and a bear. Are you gonna team up? Or are you gonna fight each other? Really? All right, anyone else? Yep, come here. Right. The Atronarch Stone is over here. from the Atronauk Stone. We need to go... Okay, somewhere around in one of these little pools. What does the Atronauk Stone do? Under the sign you absorb a portion of income and spell damage and have a larger pool of magic but recover it more slowly. Yes, why not? Bless me. Bless me with this. Being blessed by all sorts of um, deities. Any mods I'm personally waiting to be updated? Uh, SKSE. Um, guard dialogue overhaul. Serena relationship dialogue overhaul. Uh... Engine bug fixes, uh, distant LOD generator stuff, just off the top of my head. Uh, amazing follower tweaks. Okay, so in one of these little pools is something interesting, but we'll have to find it. That's just a preliminary build. It doesn't still fully support, um, or rather, the mods I'm waiting to be updated to haven't been updated to support the preliminary build of SKSE. There's not like a 
a finished build of script extender out yet. It's just a preliminary. Which works like 90%. Um, but you still have to wait for mod authors to update their plugins to that version. Right, keep your peepers peeled. Okay, it's not in this one. What's the bet? And it's in the big one. This reminds me of like rock pooling at the beach. Looking for crabs. What might this be? Whoa! Oh. Shadow rend. So it's changing between a war axe or a claymore or is that a one-handed sword i think it's a claymore very nice and a little uh crispy skeleton i think i might go for well, actually, I'm going to save and I'll look at both kinds. Yeah, I am feeling Claymore, but I want to see if the stats are different on the Warhammer. Whoa! Can I not take it? What was that? Hello? Through, the, through a glass darkly? Can I help you? Is this your weapon? Defeat your, sh defeat your shadow. Oh my god, it's a copy of Arabelle! Wait! I don't like confronting my own problems! Where are you? Okay? Arabelle Kassane Shadow. Oh, this is cool. Oh! Wait, what did- Oh, she's using Shadow Rend. I see. You're not very strong. Wait, don't say that about yourself. Don't insult me! Are you going to heal during combat with magic? I'd never do that. That's right. Stab myself in the back. They'll sabotage its finest. Right. Where is it? That was sick. I was not expecting that. Claymore. Shadow Rend added. Oh, can I have both? Oh, I can have both. Oh, wait. Oh, you can swap it out at the pool. Sick. Target is 50% weaker to magic for 30 seconds. Nice. Okay, what's the claymore do? This was very well done. Oh, I like the effect on it. I love the effect on it. Man, I want armor with an effect on it like that. All smoky. That's sick. Oh, same enchantment. Targets 15% weaker to magic for 30 seconds. That's cool. Nice. Yeah, very, um, cool idea there to have to fight your shadow. I like it. Now, where did I leave Donglas?
That was cool, I like that. I don't know what you're talking about, Nugget. That doesn't sound like something that would happen to my stream. Welcome back, though. I'm only joking, it did crash. It, it crashed, Nugget! It crashed! Right, Douglas. Right. What, uh... What one are we going to go for next? We did that one quite quick as well. Uh, oh, now can I do this one? Because this one is actually sick. Smuggler's trade note at a bandit camp west of Dragon's Reach. Looking forward to this one. Oh, I think I know what camp it's going to be as well. Oh, I was going to say, is uh, Speckles going to show up over there, but they didn't. You know that our supply is limited. It could be a season or more before we get a new shipment from the south. Rasad, you're just like openly talking about doing shitloads of skoom. <laughs> what, a, what a boy. The longer we travel, the right. Do you have any Pepe dolls for sale? You do. I will buy it. Right. Oh, you've got on my left. Okay, do you have any health potions? Okay, Rasag, good doing business with you. I will see you next time. Back to luck. All right, Nugget. Put the thought out of your mind. Yes, repress the thought of the skoom. Now. Yeah, I expected um, them to work like DLC. Like typical DLC, that like as soon as you do the tutorial, the game's like one after another. Go here and do this! You get this quest! Like, and just cram it all down your throat straight away. It is cool that it's fed to you slowly throughout the game kind of thing, or you can just find it. Um, they implemented that part well. Uh, right. That's West. Bandit Camp West. Yeah, I'm not a fan of that way of delivering content to the player personally okay that is not a bandit camp that is a uh well that's a crab that's a giant camp now this isn't really a camp it's a fort but Unless it's here. This doesn't look like a camp though, it's just a burnt down house. I'm sure modders will come along and, you know, tat about with them. I've already seen. Uh, some mods changing stuff.
Hello, everybody. I have come looking for a book. Do you mind if I come inside and look for it? <laughs> the sword's sick. Oh, how dare you? Oh, Donglas, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hit you. You're now 5% less resistant to magic or whatever it was it said. Nice one, Donglas. All right, anyone else? Didn't think so. Yeah, this might not be the bandit camp that it that it speaks of. Yeah, that's a much better way, I think, of getting the armor, definitely. Oh, I think I know what place it's talking about. Longless, we have needlessly come in here and killed these bandits. They're terrible. I know of one camp that's across this bridge that it could be. It's talking about this one over here that's like tucked away. That seems more west than being over here. That mammoth just fall out of the sky? Yeah, I think it's the one over here. Oh, but there is also a bandit camp there. Could be that one, actually. Try this one first. Are they already aggroing? Oh, okay. Thought they might get standoffish before they aggroed. Alright, fine. Let's go. That's right, Dongles. You get him. How did I hit Dongles and not you? No, I was expecting it. You were aiming right at me. Mercy? Get him, Dongles. The sword is so long, I keep hitting. Donald, an accident! How dare you! Hello? Right. We are looking 
for a book or note rather I did merge with the horse me and Dongle are one spiritually despite how much of a sass lord he is Okay, what if it's on their person? The Wolf Queen? That's what I want. What about that lady I decimated? Where is she? Dongles, did you see where she went? Oh, there she's just standing on her. Nope. So it's not on them. It'll be in here somewhere. Oh! That doesn't sound good. <laughs> Can't seem to pick up that potion for some reason. Okay. Weird. Oh, now I'm stuck. Okay. I think it might be the first one that I said. Right underneath. Uh, Dragon's Reach. was there that spike pit that's a whoa i never knew that existed that's cool and dangerous let's not fall in there dongle shall we yeah careful right. now it's not necessarily west Oh, it might be west, actually. That cave over there. I think it could be that place. Is it west? It's quite... Really? Slap those wolves aside. And there is that west. It's kind of west. It could be this place. Riding an elven armored horse while wearing crusader armor. <laughs> Rolling in his grave, yeah. Right. Oh, I think it might be, because there's actually a lot of stuff here. Hello, I've come looking for a note. Is that okay? Now, ain't this a surprise? That's all you've got. Can I help you? <laughs> what were you saying? Unfortunate. Oh, they have another horse. Hello, horsey. You are free. Aha! Smuggler's note. Let us perch and read said note. Akari, you can take those prices and eat them. We found our own source of skooma now, the real stuff, not that watered-down third-hand trash you've been selling. And don't even think of ratting us out. One word to the guards, and I'll make sure they know that that seer of yours is what that seer of yours is really up to. Ooh. I have a feeling that it should be like Dudun Quest beginning. No? Oh, wrong note. <laughs> this is the right note. There we go. 
The new source has been a real boon. Skooma, poisons, black soul gems, you name it. We've got a line, uh, we've got a line to a wide range of goods and even a wider range of clients, which means someone uh, needs to tell. All oh, right, so it is kind of related to the other note. Akari, where she can stick her bottles uh, of sugared cat piss, we're done. Meanwhile, we're filling up our uh, coffers faster than we can empty them. We're drinking day by, we're drinking day and night and still haven't got through half the gold from that Morrowind job uh, for the corpse fondlers. <laughs> the corpse fondlers. <laughs> uh, with Argonian patrols up and down the border, we can... Who this, Arthur? Thank you very much, Arthur. Oh, got so excited. Thank you very much, Arthur, for that 22-month resub. How you doing, dude? How's your day been? Galaxy going in with all them crowns. Whoa, first win in like 30 tries. You, but you're forgetting the point. The point is that you won, and therefore casino not corrupted. Yeah? Cool. Yes, hey, you and Arthur. You doing good? Awesome. Uh, where were we? Oh, yes. Corpse fondlers. With Argonian patrols up and down the border, we can charge an arm and a leg and a tail for every crate that comes in. As for the zombie petters, they were pretty pleased the staff wasn't damaged. Creepy looking thing, too. Was glad to be rid of it. It's a shame we couldn't hold out a couple more days, though. This morning, another buyer came by the camp. And an orc with a face so lumpy he must have jumped headfirst off of the top of Dragon's Reach. Turns out he was looking for the same staff, offering to pay double. I told him we could have something better for him on the next boat from Solstein, but he was pretty sodding clear there was only one staff he wanted to buy. Makes sense. The only thing uglier than his face <laughs> is that staff. Maybe he wants us to maybe he wants to hold it up when he shaves. So he doesn't feel bad for being born. <laughs> wow. Anyways, I sold him the information on the buyers and sent him on his way. Couldn't get him to trade. Couldn't get him to trade any of my va any of the valuables on his carriage. But it's all right. There's more than one way to part a fool from his things. I told the boys to cut him off on the road west of Whiterun, at a burnt down house, between the Watchtower and Fort Greymore. We were just there. Given how obsessed he was about the staff, it's easy to catch him off guard. firmly believe that this casino is very fair. Thank you. Donglas, we have a new adventure to go on. But I have to pee. Oh, Oval. Uh, so the crowns at the bottom of the Twitch chat are separate to the crowns that you gamble with. It's a little bit confusing because I've named them both crowns. Uh... If you do exclamation point crowns, it'll tell you how many crowns you have for gambling. Right, I gotta pee real quick, so I'm a burb. It's the baby, look. The baby. Look at the baby. Oh, my baby.
so the gambling crowns uh, were set up years ago on the channel before the Twitch points thing came out. Um, so yeah, they're like separate. I wasn't aware that you could set up uh, the stream points though to like gamble with or whatever. If you can, then um, that'd be pretty cool because then I haven't got to have two types. What about more crowns? To immediately gamble away. Okay, thanks. Oh. Thank you, Lib, for my rap. Look at that. Doing look nice. Yeah, glad you're good, Arthur. Thank you for that resub, my dude. Oh, Rebel. Yeah, I like his streams. Pretty sure he raided us a couple months ago. Yeah, maybe, actually. Isn't he a partner? I'd have to double check. Um, or you could be able to set it up with, like, custom, like, coding or whatever. I'll have to have a look. Right, so the little burnt out house is literally over here. We're gonna go all spec ops. You wait there, Donglas. No more hero stuff, okay? Let mama go do this. Oh yeah, I never... What are you doing? There we go. Ah. There's the dead orc on the road. Oh! There's a dude next to him. He might be friendly, who knows? Why would he attack me for just walking? Did he kill him? Did the orc kill him? Oh, is he about to kill me? <laughs> Hello? Never should have come here. Oh, fine. You know, you're, all right. Fine. I don't blame you. You were just attacked. Why would you not assume that I would do the same? Okay, all right. If you're going to be fancy, I can be fancy as well. Look at him shooting the little icicles at me. Poke it out. Come on. Just a tip. Let's go. Was that frenzy or flee? I think you might be scared. You scared? Don't worry, friend. Uh, that's not called yielding, that's called healing, and you better not do that ever again. Where are you going? I fought worse than you. you sure? What? How's that not hit? Friend, less of that, yes. Oh, 
you really gonna be like this? Stop hiding. Thank you. Modig, is that his name? Modig Gilgar. I'm sorry, Modig. Established maid. Majehood. Sorry, embellished. One about. Uh, smuggler's ledger. I'll take that tome, why not? Oh, do I want the fire? Full staff? Can I carry it? Yes. Take my arrows back as well, thank you very much. Alright, what about the people that tried to kill him on the road? Are oh, you a part of one of those raids? Oh, okay, cool. Uh, I actually used to have a mod that made enemies go passive when they scream, I yield or mercy. Oh, cool. I could hear someone walking then. Oh, I'll take those. Right. Uh, read the ledger. Items. Dozen bottles of skooma delivered to Delvin Mallory in Riften. I wonder why. Smuggler's fee. 50 septims and a favor. Knowing the Delvin, the discount is worth it. At least this time around. Items. Staff of Host Doki. Void salt. Soul gems. Bone meal. Delivered to Avara of Oldenveld and Lushka Gra Ragdam. Brittleshin. At Brittleshin Pass. Smuggler's fee. Just golden gems for now. It was tough sneaking in some of the items on the list, but the zombie lovers were happy for with the haul. They say they're trying to open a portal to something called the Soul Cairn. If there's loot to be had inside, it might be a good idea to line up some buyers. Uh, items. Cane book delivered to Bandit's White River Watch. Smuggler's fee. Uh, Havar paid with a dagger and some farmer's cloves with blood still on it. Uh, the cane was a foot short, but it serves the bastard right for not paying in gold. I told him if he, uh, if he wants better service... He's going to have to learn how to fight with his eyes open. Right. wonder if you go to the other two places, you can actually find the items he delivered. But we're only interested in... Uh, yeah, the Necromancers in Brittle Shin Pass. Isn't too far away. Nice. Where did I leave uh, Longless? Oh, I see him. It's put like a torch on him or something. I can find him in the dark. You need some reflective strips on your armor. The horse is already wearing gold. Does it need LEDs attached to it? Yes, it needs uh, RGB compatibility. Uh, otherwise, I'm not interested in the horse armor.
Oh, yeah, we leveled. Looks like Dong just got a flamethrower attached to his saddle. That's right, he's going warp speed. All right. Might not want to go in there, little elk. Is that wolf still following me? Oh, I can't be bothered to wait for him. Wait there, Dong Donglas. Be good. That's right. Right. I think I might go Rune's Edge. Follow me now. Uh, a Meridian or whatever, somewhere like that, I think. No, Book of Silence? Book of Silence. Might be Book of Silence. I hear spooky, scary skeletons. So far, I'm liking the design of this place. That's really cool. Kind of reminds me of someone's like zip lined into the cave from the top. It's really cool. I can hear someone singing. Do you guys hear that? I heard someone sing. Someone's singing. Well, that's ominous. By Azura, by Azura, by Azura. I can hear you, but I can't see you. Are you up there? Oh, that's where we have to go? Okay. Awesome cave design. Very nice. Yeah, sick looking. Hello, Haz. Welcome back, dude. This is cool. I would like more stealthy Assassin's Creed looking places like this. Really nice job. Oh, the singing has stopped. I can't tell if that's a skeleton over there. I feel like it might be. No, it wasn't. Okay. It was my imagination. Must have been the wind in my eyes. The singing, though, was cool. It's very creepy that it stopped, though. Okay. It's a person. And I'm guessing there's going to be another person over there. Now, considering they're, like, sacrificing a guy, they're probably not going to be the friendliest people. Really? Oh, that's Avara, the one from the letter. Oh yeah, the necromancers, aren't they? There's Lushka. Where are you going, Lushka? Thank you. You're welcome. Are they hiding? Oh, here comes the skellies. Oh! 
Okay. Oh. Ivara doesn't mess around. Wait, 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 wait. Whoa, whoa. Jesus. <laughs> Am I alive? Aaron, I'll get up. You get. Oh, God, no. You're going to fall. You okay? Oh, my God. Your arm okay? Oh, shit. Oh, they're all. They're all up now. Oh god! Wait! Help! Oh. Dude, she is a spell flinger. Where'd she go? There she is. She's healed. Oh my god! <laughs> Help! Oh! What's my health saying? Is it okay? Oh my god, my arms. She keeps breaking my arms. Oh my god, there's a storm cloak. You know what? If you're gonna play like that, so you can play like that. Wait, wrong sword. Where's Shadow Run? Oh, am I alive or dead? Oh! Somehow he's missing me with every shot. Oh! Oh! Okay, she's nearly dead. She, she's nearly dead. Okay, head out, Avara. Come on. Or you could just put the staff down and walk away. Oh! <laughs> My arm's gonna be broken again. Where is she? Avara? Retrieve the necromancer's staff. That was, uh, she very kindly dropped it up against the wall for me when she died. Hello, Avara. Avara's notes. Staff of Hostoki. If target dies within 60 seconds, fills a soul gem. Knocks back the target on impact while not, while not attacking... Creates a ward that protects against spells for up to 40 points. So this is a staff that you can find in Morrowind. Don't know if you can find it in the first two Elder Scrolls games though. My first, um... Like, sighting of it was Morrowind. Completed the staff of Hostoki. That was a sick, sick uh, dungeon. Really enjoyed that. Where is it? Nice. Love the face on it. Cool. Now where's uh, that orc? Close call. Thought you said ever uh Elvira. Thought you died, yeah. I 
free ward. Yeah, the uh, shield gives us a free ward as well. We're like super warded up now. Didn't realize it was sticking its tongue out. Yeah. All right, I want to see what they had up top. I can't remember what the enchantments are on it in Morrowind. Dwarven boots. Oh no! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I'm gonna just not pick that up. Yep. Yeah. Okay, cool. Not today, Meridia. What a weird place to find it, though. Uh, it's Meridia's beacon, so when you pick it up... Uh, Meridia is like, a new hand touches the beacon, and she keeps complaining and whining until you take the beacon all the way back to her. And I don't want to bother with her. Who touches the beacon? Black soldier. Oh! Hi! I'm sorry, I didn't realize you, I would have, you know... Not rudely been looting if I realized there was someone to save. Hi. Zora Fairchild. Are you an interesting NPC? Do you mind keeping that close? Uh, okay. Rude. <laughs> Why, yes. It's quite comfortable in here. But when it's open, there's a bit of a drag. It has holes in it. <laughs> you do realize that was a joke, don't you? I didn't expect my hero to lack a sense of humor. Expecting someone more dashing? Your standards are too high, I'm a true hero, and very attractive. Yeah. Yes, a beautiful girl you are. Ah, but before we weren't for a beauty face. Or a swift way, depending on the beauty. But it always leaves, without so much as a goodbye. Or a farewell party. It's quite rude. Um... So you're gonna come out of the cage, or am I gonna lock you in there? Get you everywhere in the world, I'm afraid. I'm sorry, Zora, but it is true. Okay. It was a completely defensive staff in Morrowind. Yeah, I didn't remember it actually being useful for like attacking things, apart from you could physically hit someone with it, but it wouldn't really do anything. Yeah, you're gonna come out of the cage. Well, I guess that's it. But I do like squares. She reminds me of Vila. <laughs> no, must not get attached. Zora, Until next time. you are free to go. Come and go as you please. I have things to do, okay? <laughs> Goodbye, then. Reckon she knows Vila? Right! <laughs> she probably is friends of Vila. Disrespect. You know, I've never been in here. Ever. Ooh. And I'm assuming it's a vanilla cave if it has an interesting NPC inside. An exit. If this is a vanilla cave, it looks sick. How have I never been in there before? Test the ward F. Oh, I forgot that it does that. Oh. Oh, damn. <laughs> Not utilizing my staff.
I don't know if interest in NPCs is finished or not, um, but at some point in time they did accept uh, voice actors. Um, like you could apply, you could send them off a voice reel. You could actually, um, so the website they used where you would like submit your voice reel, like, uh, it's a website that like professional or like in, uh, aspiring voice actors use to upload their voice reels for like jobs and stuff. Oh, this is gorgeous out here, dude. But, oh, some of the, some of the auditions, the, just like the Khajiit ones in particular, were so amazing. Oh, and I can fish here as well. And there's a fishing rod. Oh, amazing. It's a vanilla dungeon. Where, where are we even? I've never been in there. Never. To my knowledge. <laughs> to my knowledge, never been in there. That's like, I don't know if I have a mod that changes the inside of it at all. But... It looks cool inside. Really cool. Dude, been playing Skyrim for 10 years. Just found a cave I ain't been in before. I love this game. Uh, right. Need to find the... The next thing to do. Oh, sorry, my chat's frozen. I have to refresh. It looked the same. They did a nice job in there. More caves. That is what I asked for. <laughs> I asked for more caves. Okay. So next we're going to do... Actually, let me just double check. I haven't got any um, quests outstanding. Bones for a crow, is that one? I think Bones for a crow might be one. We should watch Shrek soon. Somebody once told me the world is macaroni. Oh, I don't think Bones for a Crow is one. Okay. Uh. Oh, okay, hang on. How? Where's this one? I can be purchased in Markov. Yeah, you know what? This is a very infamous bit of Creation Club content that sparked controversy. And I've never seen it in game. So let's go have a look at it. South Fringe Sanctum. Ooh. Yeah, because I was saying last stream that like the dungeons get really samey in this game, and there's one I haven't seen before. That's really cool. Hello, Nugget. Perhaps, King, you just always end up going in similar dungeons. 
Yeah. That's for all. Yeah. Hey King, what software do you use to edit videos? Uh, Adobe Premiere Pro. Right. What are you hiding, priest? I'm not hiding anything. It's closed for a reason. Excavation site is I took you I I'm sorry I spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Alright. Ownership deed mud crab. Spell tome teleport pet mud crab added. I cannot what? wait. Ah, so you're an alchemist then. I think he might be. Um do you mind getting out of the way? I'm trying to use my mud crab. Thank you. I don't care about the Dawn Guard. Right. Spell tome for summon pet mudcrab. Mudcrab boy! Uh. Oh, I can't wait! Where is he? What? <gasps> there he is! Oh, let me take you outside. Yes, we will, uh, we'll call him Mud Lobster. Call him Muddy. He dared to find me? I didn't even look at how much I paid for him, actually. <laughs> I didn't look at the price. What's that boy's name? Name's Muddy. Mud Lobster is his official name. Mr. Mud Lobster. Come with me, Muddy. Squeal! Come, my friend. This teleport spell does not work. He has little armor and I love him. Can he not door? He can't teleport, apparently. You don't see uh, Manny and uh, Demi not teleporting. I bet you any money, right? If I was to teleport Manny and Demi right now, they would appear instantly on the spot because they are a good boy and girl. 
Look at that. Do you mind explaining? Maybe he's just shy. Come with me. You must dismiss your pets before you can recruit another. Do you not play well with friends? Okay. Manny, you came first. Demi, I'm sorry, but it is time for you to go. Wait for me in the city. Wine. Wait for me in... Uh... A white run. Grumble. Goodbye, Demi. Right, Muddy. Muddy? Don't let my uncle go on about his theories. Come with. Too many petos. <laughs> look at him, look at him, zoomies! Oh! He's a quick boy. He is cute, I like him. Apparently when he came out years ago, well, I guess it's because you had to pay for him with real money. Everyone was like, the Creation Club is shit. You have to pay real money for a crab that just follows you. And he goes into the ground. Doesn't matter where he is. Immersion breaking. Oh, Demi. I'm sorry, Demi, but... Muddy. I will come see you again another time, okay? I promise. I promise. Can you use a door? He's so clever. He was a cute boy. Heartless. Demi's like, you betray me. <laughs> Look at him walk away. <laughs> Hello, Rocket. How you doing, dude? The crab is a student of dog meat blocks your path like a companion sorry like a champion and muddy just here pulling a face look at him oh come muddy we have many more adventures to go on i want to see where demi <laughs> goodbye demi Look at that boy. Sad walking away music. Okay, just really tired. Just a nightmare bug walking down the street. Oh. Right. Uh. Oops. Right, are you ready, Muddy? You're going on an adventure. Then we're walking away, waddle, 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 till the very next day. Dum, bum, 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 ba -dum. What must the citizens of Skyrim think of you when they see a giant insect from the realm of insanity walking alone down the street? And they just shrug it off as that crusader woman's pet. <laughs> it's just that... Dunma with her strange pets again. She is... She loves all animals and creatures. Apart from skeevers. Hold there. Yes. Before I let you into Riftum, you need to pay the visitor's tax. Oh, of course. Right away. How, um, how you rude of me. Ah! 
Thank you. Welcome to Rifted. Till the very next quest. Bum 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 bum. <clears throat> Why do you have a torch during the day? Because it was night time a minute ago. At some point, I think. <laughs> Yes, I, uh, yeah, I might actually like Skeevers if they were little hammy boys. I had another run in with a thief's guild. Oh, it's my first wife. Be careful, my lord. The thieves' guild has made in black right. back. One snap of I don't know you. You and Rip. I don't know you either. Pretend not to hear me all I'm really getting tired of Okay, B and Bob. Could have gave Demi grapes. <laughs> Never thought of that. I'll do that to get into Riften from now on. <laughs> right. Uh, I am now looking for... Whilst this guy is screaming about dragons... Your constant inebriation. Put down your flagons filled with your vile liquids and embrace the teachings of the handmaiden of time. No, no, Mama. We talked about this. Talon? Kira, certainly we can come to some sort of an understanding. These people yeah. must be made What's aware of the chaos they've sown. Enough, Mama. We've all heard of the dragons and their return. There's no need to use them as an excuse to harass our customers. Very well, Talon. I'll remove myself from this den of iniquity. Den of iniquity. Just keep the I remove myself from this den of debauchery. Letter to Clexius. Started blue in the face. Dear Clexius, it's as you feared. The news here in Riften is troubling on so many levels. Now, I've studied goblins all my life, and while customs differ from tribe to tribe, one thing has always held true. They are behold to their shamans, and removing them will turn the entire tribe docile. Moreover, we have seen this method work in practice most famously with the Three Feather Tribe near Bruma. That's a quest in Oblivion! That I think we even did that one. Cool. Uh, yet still the rumors persist of goblin activity near the border. Most disturbing is the news that the Blue God himself is leading them. Could it be Malakath himself in some form? <laughs> Hello, Mao. Thank you very much for the 18 month B Bay. Thank you very much. How you doing, man? How are things? Uh, <clears throat> Most disturbing is the news that the Blue God himself is leading them. Could it be Malakath himself in some form? Regardless, if some Daedric being has found its way to this realm, this is a cause for concern. I'll be heading to Grom's Pass in the morning to investigate. Faithfully yours, Avanes Caladius. Nailed his name. Nailed it. Muddy? Oh, there you are. Grom's Pass. Good, man. I'm glad you're good. Change mods that affect NPCs. Some look amazing. Others are back to vanilla. It's jarring. Do you know what else is jarring? How this guy is not sitting on the thingy. He's just floating. I mean, just... Look at that. How is that possible? I mean, look at his face. Side eye me as if he's not actually sat down. He thinks he doesn't know. He thinks we don't notice. He thinks we don't notice. <laughs> right. Come, Muddy. He's doing expert squat levels. Oh, his his thigh muscles must be insane. Any luck with the house hunt? Maybe, kinda. Yeah. Might be too soon to say anything, so... If anything good comes of it, uh, we'll let you guys know next week. I appreciate you asking, though, dude. Uh, where is the pass of the Grom? Grom Pass. Grom Passle. Uh... Oh, it's down here somewhere. Ah, 
Stendar's beacon. We will travel there and then travel with the Grom. Your crimes have made you unfit to wh what? What crimes? I mean, I killed someone. What? I have to keep. I have to keep praying at the shrine. What do you mean? Some made me unfit to not wear it. I'm wearing it, and I'm gonna keep wearing it. All right. Xanathar, okay, I don't care that I forgot your name. Smite me down, oh mighty smiter. Right, let's go. Wrong way. Nice armor, yo. <laughs> Thanks, the gods don't approve. <laughs> hope it goes well, mate. Moving is shite, especially right now. Yeah, I really hope you guys get something settled soon. Cheers, man, I appreciate it. Yeah, hopefully soon. Gotta do it again? I ain't doing it again, man. It says I'm not worthy of wearing it, yet here I am, still clad, so it can shut up. Deserve it, like, yeah. Hello. Oh, Xenathar bear. He just threw a skull at me. Holy shit. Oh my god, there's two Xenathar bears. Oh! Donglas, you'll be fine outside, right? Oh wait, what am I saying? What am I saying, Donglas? I possess the staff of Host Doki. <laughs> you dare fight me, bear of Zenithar! I'll show you what it means to disrespect me! That's right, Donglas, get him. You show him what for. Move your big fluffy butt out of the way. That's right. Get him, Donglas. Be gone! It's gonna take a while if I'm gonna punch him to death. Blast his ass off. Staff of staff of proper push. Your horse's bum is so chunky it's hypnotizing. He does have quite a wide load, doesn't he? Does the uh, staff of host Doki let you carry more or something? Oh my god, a goblin! Oh, I got another one! I thought you beasts only existed in Cyrodiil! They're doing a really good job modeling them. Sick. Oh yeah, we should probably level. Oh god damn boy, you hot. He's gorgeous. Oh, the armor sin stop you regenerating? Well, I ain't wearing this armor anymore then. I'm gonna spend my life praying to deities day in, day out just to wear some armor. Oh, you're right, I have no stamina. So I have to have like perfect moral standing, otherwise the armor debuffs me. I mean, that's a cool Open your maps effect, but your I'm not about that life. <laughs> well, the consume of the ages. Uh, let's go for two-handed. Right, come along, muddy. There are goblins in here. Now that is what I like to see. Oh, wow, look how many people they've killed. <gasps> I 
Okay, that's the lady who wrote the note and was trying to warn everyone about the goblin invasion. She met the same fate as everybody else. Stay close, buddy. The hell was that? That was scary. <laughs> scary ass noise. Whoa! <laughs> I love this stuff, bro. <laughs> Whoa! He was invisible! Kill the blue god! Where is he? Wait, is he a person? Blue god? Oh my god, he's blue! He's actually- he's a blue orc! Come on. <gasps> he's holding the shaman staff! Let me see your face. He's covered in like blue war paint. Oh! There's another goblin down there. Who? Oh wait, I killed the shaman, so now they're not gonna hurt people, are they? Hi! Oh, okay. Alright, well that was mean. Now you're gonna die. Yeah, they've done a sick job making these. I'd like a mod that just, like, adds them to the level, like, enemies list or something and disperses them throughout the game. That would be sick. And what does this do? Oh, crap. I didn't realize I was here. Wait, what? Failed. Read the Blue God's journal. Wait. Wait, wait. No, I, I want it. I want it. I missed law. Fuck's sake. That, no, I saved. I saved. I saved after that. Goblins are back. I know. Kind of looks like the genie. Ah, oh, it's because I. Because I betrayed Demi. Is what I get. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I will pay these consequences for hurting Demi's feelings. It's fine. It's fine. I am unworthy. I can't wear the Crusader armor. Like, Demi has forsaken me. Hold them. Before I let you into Riften. You need Got anything smart you want to say? That's right, turn around. <laughs> He's like, I didn't see anything. It's that Ara del Kassane lady again. I'm not doing guard duty. She killed the last guard by just looking at him. And she always has that mud crab with her. <laughs> With the Thieves Guild. Shut up. You are the Thieves Guild. I'm really getting tired of your excuses. When you what just happened? Uh, I messed up a quest, so I reloaded. You've got the coin. You've come to the right place to pull up the seat. People of Riften, heed my word. Stay away from this place of debauchery and sin. Yeah. Hello, Sapphire. Yeah. What's your problem? Uh Can't fast travel while guards are pursuing you? What guard is pursuing me? Pray tell. The one I killed? Is there a problem? Wait. 
I know you. Do you? You're making a mistake. There's no mistake. You're a wanted woman. Oh. And it's time to pay for your crimes. But I interest you in a Dwemer mud crab. One gold? Good enough. I'll just confiscate any stolen goods you're carrying. Then you're free to go. Wait. Oh, he took one of my arrows. Okay, oh, that's fine. My advice. Shut up, I don't want your advice. <laughs> one septum, I know. Right. Uh, now that we are clean and holy once more, as the divines intended, must have been a petty crime. I mean, I did just kill a guard by looking at him. <laughs> But they have no evidence that so that was me. He could have had a heart attack. Bongles. Go. Look, my crimes are my business. All right. Well, this armor was fun whilst it lasted. But I will not be repenting every five seconds. <laughs> the debuff might not appear now. I mean, it might be back now. Because the thing popped up. Bear, I have toiled with you long enough. I care not. But before I leave, take two of these. friend this is a great little staff to just like shunt people away from you <laughs> I love it oh 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 he's running on the spot killed him so hard he doesn't even know what he's doing come muddy Kill the blue god. Yeah, I have a staff too, friend. love this thing. <laughs> right. I'm gonna read his journal. The Blue God's journal. Goblin Totem Staff. Again, they've done a sick job of modeling that. Really cool job. Lightning Bolt that does 40 points of shock damage to health and after Magicka, then leaps to a new target. Very nice. Ring of Minor Illusion. And his journal says... It's blue! Hang on! <laughs> it's, it's got blue paint on it like he's been holding it. That's sick. Sorry, I really liked that. Uh, the tribe demanded I prove myself as a hunter. Day one. They wanted me to trap some game and return it to the stronghold. Probably for, for a celebratory feast. Shouldn't be too hard. I already set up a snare by the water. Now I can just sit back and let the food come to me. Day two. My snare trap doesn't seem to be working. I tried... I tried I tried it to a tied it to a stick just like they said. Clearly Lob gave me a flimsy rope. Either that or the sticks out here are no good. I don't know what they expect me to hunt with such broken tools. Day three. It's only been a few days, but I already feel like giving up. I'm hungry and I've gone through all the bread A tub gave me. 
Bye, Malakaf. They really expect me to die out here. Day five. The rabbits here are too nimble to chase down. I thought I could just grab one if I put my bait in my pocket. Problem is, I don't have any bait. I shouldn't have eaten all the carrots in my sack, but I was starving. Day six. Malakaf's blessing. I'm alive. I found a cave south of my camp full of strange blue mushrooms, which I immediately ate. Good choice. I remember Atub saying something about those mushrooms being poisonous, but I didn't get sick, so what does, what does she know? Anyway, I ended up filling my sack with them. Uh, if I come back with a full stomach, maybe I can convince the others we don't need to hunt. Day seven. I came back to uh, Lagashpa. I came back to Lagashpa. I guess that's like an orc stronghold with my sack full of mushrooms and one Open by one. I was waiting for that. <laughs> in your mouth. Excuse me. <laughs> I came back to. Lagashpur with my sack full of mushrooms and one by one they spit them out and mocked my hunting skills. Uh, if that wasn't humiliating enough, Chief Yam Yamaz took a hammer and crushed the sack, then dumped the contents on my head. None of my tribe mates bothered to defend me, they just stood there and laughed. Now Yamaz says, I have to go back out there and catch something with some legs. Uh, it's not fair. When's the last time he caught anything? Day 8. I'm so hungry. Hunting is impossible. Maybe I'll just die. That'll teach them to leave leave me out here all alone. But I'm Malakath. Uh, what just happened? I went back to the cave to pick some more mushrooms when something must have tripped, tripped me because I fell into a pit. I yelled out for help, but instead of getting rescued, I was quickly surrounded by a horde of green monsters hissing and gnashing their teeth. I figured that it was- I, th I figured that was it. They were going to eat me. But before I could scream, one of them dropped to his knees and started bowing. The others followed. Could they be goblins? You never see them this far north. In any case, they seem to be treating me like an honored guest. Day 11. Blessings of, Ma of Malakath. It turns out they think I'm a god. They don't seem to treat the other orcs the same, so it must be the blue stains on my face. I need to thank your Mars for dumping that sack on my head. I love this story. I think, uh, I think I'll do that right before I have my goblins or open his face. Day 15. My army grows by the day. Soon we'll have enough numbers to overrun the stronghold. For now, I've been collecting blue mushrooms from Cyrodiil so I can maintain the ruse. Although some of them might be starting to suspect. The other day, I think one of them saw me use a stick to spread blue paint on my back. Uh, I'll need to keep a close eye on him. Day 18. I figured out who it was that saw me. It's that nasty little runt with the funny-looking spear. It seems... He's the hunter of the group. He reminds me of my orc. He reminds me of every orc back in uh, Lagashba who laughed in my face. I tried to grab the spear from him, but he must have done something to it because it was too heavy to lift. I don't know if it's Hercene or Malakaf that's protecting him, but he needs to learn that goblins only have one god, the blue god, me. Day 21. The, tu the tunnel the goblins were using to come from Cyrodiil collapsed. No matter, my army is nearly big enough to take the stronghold, and once that's done, I can call Yamaz. I can sell Yamaz things for a whole wagon full of paint. Before I do that, though, I need to make an example of the non-believer. Once he's once he's dealt with, it'll show all other goblins what happened when you question your god. What a great bit of story. I wonder if the one who questioned him then is the one who's in the fighting pit. That'd be cool. Some of these uh, creation club mods have have interest in stories. Like to see a fully realized goblin mod. I mean, to be fair, now that there's like, uh, the source content, do you know what I mean? People are, are probably bound to start making goblin mods now. I'd be willing to bet. If there isn't already. Oh, muddy. Right. Wait, how did I... Oh, there must be another tunnel. Ah, here we are. Oh yeah, because one of them's mining. Seen any elves? <laughs> oh, he's a quick one. Buddy, get him. Oh, the blue mushrooms. Steel blue and Tolma. 
Paloma. Ooh. Maybe we can be the blue god. Right. Free the goblin. Speak to him. That is a sick spear. Is that Hercene's hunting spear that he gives you in Blood Moon? Uh, hold on. Gah. Hi. I take it you realize that the orc wasn't a god? Oh my god, he can be a follower? You seem friendly, uh, but so does a bear until it's chewing your face off. I've always wanted a goblin for a friend, what do you say? Uh, what do I get the feeling you're gonna follow me out of here? You can handle yourself in a fight. I could use someone like you. Do you think you want to follow me? Having a can use a companion wouldn't be a bad idea. Why do I get the feeling you're gonna be following me out of here? Alright then, let's go. Sick. A goblin follower? That's pretty awesome. Not gonna lie. I want to talk to you about your spear. Where did you find it? Uh, I don't... I don't understand. I want to talk to you about your spear. Can I try it out? Uh... I'm guessing that's a no. <laughs> uh, we'll trade things with you. Troll skull, skull added? Give me a skull. That's that isn't what I meant by trading. I want to trade things with you. Oh, so I guess if he finds random crap, he'll give it to you because he thinks it's like, oh, this is cool. She'll want that. I need to change your equipment. Let's change your helmet. Let's change your armor. Iron armor, leather, no armor. Leather. Dude, let's change your helmet. Skull mask, no helmet. Iron helmet. You look way better with a skull mask. That's all. It's time for us to part ways. Now I'm curious. I'm sorry, little friend. Oh, he can't die. He just downs. That is Hercene's spear, though. It is, man. It's Hercene's spear, I bet you. you. Hercene gives you that when you win the wild hunt thing at the end of the DLC. He is blessed by her scene. Okay, he's sick. I love him, and I'm going to keep him. He's essentially a glorified animal follower. He is amazing. The only canonical spear since Morrowind. Oh, yeah, true. Oh, my God. Oh, God. I love you so much. Talk to you about your spear. Oh, man. Sick. Is he going to follow me now, yeah? Dude, he's awesome. Okay, I really, really like this mod. This one's really good. Sweet. Yeah, that's it. The Spear of Bitter Mercy, right? Isn't that what it's called? The one that her scene gives you? Maybe he knows how to speak your language over time. That would be sick if he could learn to, to speak, uh, like Tamrielic or whatever they call English in this game. That'd be sick. I love him. He's amazing. Ah, oh, he's so cool. Oh. Cyrodiilic. What do I call it? Tamrielic? Yeah, 